Howdy everyone, Poacher here with an Age of Magic video and in today's video we're looking at the free to play account because we're up to a pretty decent point and we're up to a point where we need to make a decision on the account because I have been stalling a lot on it. There's been a reason for that. Um, so we're at level 75 which is awesome. Super good for us because now it unlocks the, what's it called? Rush, 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 rush. So the team I have been using is this. Either one of these is just chuck in as Ariel and Rush. That's all we've been doing. It's so good to have this. This makes it so quick. Getting TOH done daily is just a, a massive pain. So to have this now added is a huge bonus. So there's that. Um, we do okay in tournament still. However... Uh, I am think I'm going to make the choice to not care about tournament. Each week, I should be able to still earn some stage rewards, but, I mean, the nicest thing from here is probably the Indigo runes, to be honest, at the beginning, since there's the hero summoning now. Um, yeah, because of this, this is... This is nice. Um... Yeah, so my struggle at the moment is I almost just want to scrap PvP tournament-wise and focus more on just leveling up heroes and getting to the point where I can start clearing Cradle of Chaos. We're getting closer to it. We're five levels off. I will get that in the week, I believe, as long as I keep doing everything. Uh, and then my main focuses are going to be Raids and Cradle of Chaos. And I think that's where I'm going to focus my efforts. The tournament is a good source of gold. If you are a completely free-to-play player, um, tournament definitely helps. But I just, I don't know. I just feel like focusing on one area, restricting my account to one area and hindering all this other stuff is going to be more painful. So yeah, I want to get the campaigns done. I want to get to, uh, yeah, get ready for Cradle of Chaos. I'm not going to be able to do a huge amount of Cradle of Chaos, that's for sure. But anything's better than nothing. So my heroes at the moment are, yeah, we finally got some, we're finally getting some seven gold stars. Um, as you can see, I am also starting to purchase some silver tokens. I think there was two characters we had at seven gold stars. Oh, we're getting close. Getting close to Karana. We fight. We unlocked Morrigan. That was awesome. Only two stars though. But now we have Morrigan and Lion Go. So we're gonna hopefully start getting some combos out there. We also got Rock. So our we're starting to get some orcs, which is really really good for us. Uh, I really want Lascari and Dagan though. Uh, so yeah, we got a lot of. I think I got a hundred shards for Mordrake in something. Oh, it was the magic token. Um, pass shot. Yeah, I got a hundred. I got a hundred of him. Would have loved. Oh, like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven of the nine heroes I would have loved, and I got more Drake. So I mean, still a hundred shards. So there's that. But yeah, I think I'm gonna just start boosting heroes. Uh, I have not purchased or opened any arcane chests yet. I'm still saving that currency. I am, however, looking for important characters in the token shop. So as you can see, I bought Tagana, I bought Second Star Lucky. Actually, I'll probably buy a Full Metal Goon. He's not horrible, especially when it comes to Cradle of Chaos. So I'm just keeping an eye out for that. Um, as for Arena, I'm at the point where I'm not purchasing anyone. I'm not even buying Rock because I am using my TOH. Uh, in TOH, I'm buying Hody. I'm buying Arakan Guard and Rock. So that's the three characters I'm buying from here. Valley of Treasure, as you can see, it's just racking up because I'm not spending any. I'm just going to start saving it for the equipment now. Um, oh, I could buy Drake, couldn't I? Is Drake farmable? No, he's not. Okay, never mind. He's my new 
yeah, okay, we've got someone we can focus on, Drake. So Drake's now where we're going to farm. Uh, we're still, we're, I'm focusing on Mirrodin in this at all. I'm getting Mirrodin <coughs> raid. I'm actually getting Tyros in here. Uh, Palin suggests Maeve. Uh, I'm going Tyros. I just feel like Tyros is offering me more at the moment. And I really don't have any, any, um, Uh, where are they druids? Still a lot of work for these guys. Lots of work. So I'm not too worried about him just yet. We've got Wheeland. That's awesome. We're at 211k. I just noticed that. Last time I checked or paid attention, I was at 175. So yeah, I think I'm just going to start boosting a team. Um, my dark team. I don't know who I'm going to go. I think I'm going to go Arcane, Chrome, Lyango, Morrigan, and we'll stick with Zart. Or Azariel. Um, yeah, I just need to start pushing this campaign. So yeah, I am gonna break. I think yeah, I think I am at a point where I'm just gonna break away and focus on on every other part of the game. Um, who do we need? It's Arik and Undead, isn't it? Doesn't even tell me. Stop. I just want to close this, please. Yeah, Arakan. Okay, so we're starting to get these. We could probably make our way through this. I'll see how far I can get. I know they need to be seven stars, so there's that. Uh, so, yeah, that's the goal. I'm going to build two teams now, light and dark, and go from there. I don't know who I'm building for light, though. I'm obviously going to go Lucky because she's pretty strong. I'm going to go Rock. I'm probably going to go Karana, and I might go... Actually, I've got three Beastmen. I might start pumping Beastmen a little bit and see what we get with that. I also have Children of the Forest. For Bjorn, I need those. So we need to farm Tricky or Stealthy. Haven't there? Oh, yeah. He... Okay, he's in... Dark campaign. Okay, so yeah, that's just a little update on the account. Um, it is very unfortunate they nerfed these. Very, very unfortunate because this this was a really good source of gold. I mean, it, it was a lot. So I understand the nerf. I just don't think they needed to nerf it as much as they did. Um. Or even add more levels to it so you can get a little bit more gold. And what other ones were the energy? I, I'm never getting max on this anyway because um, that's a lot of energy for a free-to-play player. The silver one's obtainable. The energy one is not. And I think I got pretty far. I got a, a talisman. So we're at N... I have 10 talismans. That's massive. This is huge. If you could get down to here. I'm only 10,000 off, actually. How do I do that? I don't know if I can get. Maybe pushing some campaign and getting some more. But, yeah. Anyway, that's just an update of the account. I'm where I'm at and what I'm going to aim to do now. So, yeah, I'm going to stray away from the tournament. I'm going to build two main teams and see where we go from there. I'm going to start going up to like level 70, I think, on my two teams. And then I don't have a lot of silver for it. And I'm going to try and stall it out to get the rewards from the silver thing because as a free-to-play player, that's actually quite valuable. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below. I will answer it to the best of my ability. And we'll be around the world until next time. Please take care of yourself.